Would you like more consistent projects or sales coming from more members of your team? <laughs> Look, if you want to scale, you and your team have to know who your competition is and how to deal with them. You see, many are confident that they know how to deal with their competitors. However, the answer typically comes down to relationship price reductions or other concessions. The wrong tactic at the wrong time not only slows your progress, it also sets a precedent that you and your team will have to abide by in the future. When you ask another member of your team to contribute to capturing new projects or clients, they'll confidently rely on the same maneuvers, not even realizing there's a better option. Think about it. If you're purchasing from a vendor on a discount, concessions, or free tickets to sporting events, and they stop dishing out those incentives to you, wouldn't you interpret that change negatively and reconsider your options? So let's look at this from a different perspective. There are six types of competitors all business to business companies deal with. It could be we're holding off for now, or it could be we're going to use internal resources. It could be a small chuck in the truck competitor, a direct competitor, a mega competitor, or other ways of solving the need. Each of these competitors requires a different game plan to consistently win in order to scale your company. It's your responsibility to know each competitor well and educate your team on how to deal with them effectively. So to scale growth, we must be willing to stop relying on discounts, personality, and gimmicks to deal with the competition. Put together a specific game plan for each of these scenarios and train on how to deal with them effectively. Look, <laughs> I know it's frustrating when you're compared to an inferior solution. It doesn't have to stay that way if you're proactive, ethical, and committed to scale. So what type of competitor are you dealing with most of the time? Share in the comments section or contact me. I'll make sure to provide you with a few new ideas.